Hello and welcome to my video all about how to knit the seeded rib stitch. The finished knitting will be reversible, squishy, stretchy and it will incorporate that lovely bumpy texture that is the seed stitch. This is very easy to knit and the pattern repeat is only two rows. The first thing you need to do is cast on a multiple of four plus one. In my case I cast on 13 stitches. For the first row, which represents the right side of the knitting, you need to begin with one purl stitch. And then we're on to the repeating section of this row. So take the working yarn between the needles to the back and knit three stitches. Then bring the working yarn between the needles to the front again and purl one. And then you just need to repeat, knit three, purl one, over and over until the end of the row. So that's knit three, purl one, knit three, and the row ends on a purl stitch. Then for row two, which represents the wrong side of the knitting, you begin with two knit stitches. Then bring the working yarn to the front and purl one. And then we're onto the repeating section of this row and it's going to be the same as the previous row, which is knit three and then purl one. So knit three. And then purl one. And then just keep repeating that until you've only got two stitches remaining. And then you just knit those last two stitches. And here is the result after I repeated those two rows a few more times. As with all ribbing, you can see that it consists of hills and valleys. And that's it, that's the seeded rib stitch. I really hope you found this video useful and thank you very much for watching. 